Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings here, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, and even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell so that you find out whenever I post new videos or go live. As always, if you're already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and welcome back. Today I have my long awaited fall cause box to share with you. It came in this nice big orange box. Now to be honest I'm not super into the 70s kind of retro graphics on the box this season but these boxes are great for storage or even kind of creating a standing desk and usually if you turn them inside out that gets rid of any blemishes that might have occurred in shipping and there's usually a totally different design inside which is equally gorgeous if not more now Cosbox is $54.95 per season if you do an annual subscription you save about five dollars per box and you also get to customize some of the items and that's really why I do an annual membership because I really like to customize a little bit I think it's fun but it also ensures that you're really going to get a box that you love if you're interested in getting cause box I will leave a link in the description box below that will save you ten dollars so let's get into it so I'm already loving the interior of the box you guys it's kind of got more of like a pastel vibe definitely fall colors and so I will probably be holding on to this box and using it to store all of the things that I keep aside for giveaways. Now right on top we have got our big product magazine and it's really a magazine they do like articles and stuff and what really sets Cosbox apart in terms of lifestyle subscriptions and kind of speaks to their name as well is that they really try to work with ethical companies um, and make sure that everything is socially conscious so that's a really nice element you can feel good in supporting this box and the different companies that they work with um, so let's see we have a nice long letter from Hannah the editor-in-chief um, so I'm just gonna read a little bit about it it says I am without a doubt a homebody while I love socializing with family and friends and having an insatiable travel bug and cherish adventures near and far nothing is better than those cozy nights on the couch sipping a glass of wine and watching reality TV these quiet moments have always centered me so then later on it says first I seek out moments that make me feel warm and fuzzy inside I've been integrating these fall cause buck box products into my routine to create positive daily moments gently starting my day with a warm shower I don't want to do too many spoilers and ruin all of the surprises just in case you guys have not seen a cause box unboxing so far but they even have like a nice table of contents on the inside because again there is just so much information in here kind of looks like they changed up the format a little bit so then like a few pages in we have sort of a summary of all of the products and it makes it really clear which ones were choice items if you were able to customize so that's basically what I'll go off of and then of course I can get into the longer articles and reading about the different products and companies that they are from a little bit later on so I'm just flipping through to make sure that I'm not missing anything super important Ooh, they've got a nice uh, recipe here towards the back for homegrown basil pesto with fresh pasta which sounds delicious and very cozy all right so and then in the back they do also have a lot of coupon codes for the different companies so that's always a nice treat and usually um, in the cause box members Facebook group someone will post all of those if you want to take a look and of course if you see any products in here that you would just like to purchase on your own let me know in the comments below and I'm happy to share any of those codes with you all right you guys so they do have a little deal right now in terms of referring friends but like I said I want you guys to save that money so definitely check out the link if you're interested in in it we've got the, our classic little cause box gal sticker which I am unceremoniously tearing right now just so we can get into the good stuff I do wish that they would do like a sticker sheet because I know a lot of people like to collect these stickers and that would just be like a fun like add-on that they could include one of these days what they do do and in terms of working with an artist for each box is they do include a postcard now mine came a little bit bent in the corner but this is the postcard for this season again you can kind of see those like retro vibes I love the like color palette they worked with but again this is not necessarily something that I would um, frame but the idea is that it's like diverse women supporting one another but to me it kind of looks like they're just kind of crawling all over each other it is an actual postcard so if you did actually want to send this to someone you can but I know some people collect these and kind of change them out as part of their decor through the seasons I'm not one of those people but I, I am tend to be a little bit of a pack rat with stuff like that because you know maybe 
someday I'll come up with something that I want to do with them. All right, so now this is kind of the like hero item and you had a choice. There was a couple of choices if you're an annual subscriber. This is from Bath and you could get the waffle bath robe in mint or charcoal and that was a $90 value or you could get the waffle towel set in mint or charcoal which was also a $90 value so I appreciated that the values were similar. Now I don't have a bathrobe but I don't really use bathrobes that often. Um, I think the mint is very pretty but you guys know me I love my darker colors so I went with the charcoal uh, towel set and they're actually much thinner than I than I expected. I thought we were gonna wind up with like a giant box because I was thinking they would be more towel-like, but these are um, almost more like dishcloth texture to me. So let me just pull out one of the smaller ones. So this almost looks like a napkin or a placemat, but you can kind of see that waffle texture. Now there's been a lot of debate online about how you best care for these, if you need to iron them, how you can wash them to make sure that that knit, that texture doesn't sort of collapse on itself and get bunchy so that you're not gonna have those nice clean edges. So they actually said in an email that they recently sent out that they had different suggestions for washing and care than what were actually included with the products themselves. So I'll just have to look into it. Honestly, I like towels that I can like wash and dry and just hang up and not worry about ironing them. There's, they're not as like a wa thick waffle as I thought. It's more of like just a kind of almost embossed texture, but I do think it's pretty um, and I do think I'll use them. Uh, and it kind of goes with our bathroom is a lot of like blues and grays as it is. So we'll see. They're not like the softest things in the world. So I'm hoping maybe even though I'm not supposed to dry them, that maybe a wash or two will kind of soften them up. They're not like rough by any means but um they're just not like soft luxurious towels like like you might think of with like a terry cloth towel so i'm happy with those i don't i don't know that i would pay 90 dollars for them i mean i would definitely pay well over 90 dollars for super fancy towels but um i like these and I'll, I'll just have to see like how well they work in terms of being absorbent and drying 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 you off after your nice calming shower or bath at the end of the day all right, let's get into some other stuff. So the next thing was also a choice item and you could have gotten the glass three in one tea and fruit tumbler, um, which was an inf like an infuser and that had a $39 value or the Artisan Direct Milky Way Lantern. Um, it's written in the stars, insert a tea candle, not included, <laughs> and light up the night and that had a $40 value. So I love that those were like very distinct and separate products, but very similar in price. So I'll just show you guys a picture right here at the bottom. You can kind of see there was that tea infuser or the lantern. Now I have a tea infuser. I have a couple of tea infusers actually because I get so many subscription boxes. I'm very blessed in that way. So I went ahead and got the lantern because you guys know I love candles. So it came in this nice big box and I just, I thought it was pretty because it was like kind of a gold coppery color and I thought it would be fun to put a tea light in there and just in the evenings have that kind of cozy glow going on. So let me pull this out of the box. I just throw things on the ground. It's always like such a mess when I do these unboxings, you guys. So nicely wrapped in some more tissue. And like right now, I'm just sitting with the, the towels are just on my lap right now, you know. So it's this very nice brushed metal. I love this, you guys. I actually like it way more than I thought I would. I kind of like did it as a default choice because I didn't want another tea infuser. But this is lovely. This would actually look really nice like out on your patio as well. And you can just have this be like a, a you know, nightlight out there on your on your patio table after a barbecue towards the end you could even do like a citronella tea light in there and there's a little you can see there's a little place to put that tea light in there and then you have to use one of those either long matches or lighting sticks to do it but i love that it's got the handle i think it'll make such pretty uh little stars on the wall if you do have it inside so it's really lovely it's bigger than i expected as well so very very nice love the brushed gold i think it's beautiful and surprised surprised me i think that, that i might like that item almost the best so far so then we had another choice and there were actually three choices for this so you could have gotten the volume love scrub which had a 56 dollars value or the aromatherapy associates de-stress muscle gel which had a 39 dollars value or the tribe alive rose gold crisscross cuff which had a 42 dollars value so 
you know, one was almost $40, two of them were around $40, the Love Scrub was just slightly more. I get a ton of Bath & Body products in other subscriptions, so I didn't necessarily want the scrub. I also get a ton of jewelry items, so, and rose gold isn't my favorite, so I opted to not get the jewelry piece. So I went with actually the lowest valued item in this case, which was the Aromatherapy Associates De-Stress Muscle Gel. It says a post-workout delight with pepper and ginger, so a little, little spice going on in there. So let me just find that. This is actually a nice size. It's got some like tape on it that I'm just gonna pull off. So pretty packaging, pretty simple packaging. Here it is. So it says, the ritual, apply generously and massage into overworked joints and muscles as often as necessary. So I used to use like China gel a lot after like a big, you know, yoga workout when I would feel some soreness, but I'm pretty excited to try this. It just says focusing and soothing and we got a little over five fluid ounces. So happy to use this and maybe it will inspire me to do a little bit more in terms of working out. I probably could have used this a little bit after some of the longer hikes that my husband and I just went on on our little road trip vacation vacation, but um, there, there will be more hikes in the future, I'm sure. So the last thing that was also a choice item, so we wound up getting six items in this box. It's usually between six and eight products. You could have chosen between the Green Company set of 10 reusable facial rounds, which was worth $10, or the Buzzy Seeds Basil Grow Kit, which was also worth $10. So they did a really good job this time of making the choice items sort of in the same price point. I think it's fine to give options because you know some people aren't going to use bath products or some people aren't going to use jewelry. I think it's okay if they're in different categories but I do love that uh, the price points are very similar this time. So because I already have some reusable facial rounds and I honestly don't use a lot of makeup to need makeup remover wipes as much, um, I went with the Buzzy Seeds Basil Grow Kit which might surprise you because you guys know I do not have a green thumb. I can barely keep succulents alive. It says Herb Garden 101 freshen up margarita pizza or mix up your go-to salad greens with homegrown basil. I love getting the little basil plants like from Trader Joe's and just having those and I've definitely grown my own from like seeds and held on to it and then eventually they either just get so out of control or they just like don't come back if you go on a little trip or something that you have to get another one but this one was really cute this little kit so because it comes in this little like tin so I thought that was adorable. I'll probably put it in my kitchen window even though I do have some outdoor patio space I don't trust the bugs out there and I want it to be really accessible so that I can remember to just like you know throw throwing fresh basil into anything makes it better like if you're just making the plain you know chicken soup out of the can you can freshen that up with some basil I love it I love pesto I don't think that this will have enough uh, basil in it for me to make a big batch of pesto but like they said you can take you know a basic frozen pizza throw some fresh basil leaves on there and it just kind of elevates the whole cooking experience so very excited for this and it even has inside of this little wrapper a pesto caprese pizza recipe so that already sounds great um, and I'm very excited to give this a try so I thought that was really cute so I thought that was a nice option not like a huge like big there was no item in this box which is sort of a deviation from past boxes that was over a hundred dollars like the most expensive item was the uh, waffle knit towels or robes so I'm okay with that but because I feel like then you're getting items that are really like priced appropriately so that's that's nice um, so there's two items that came in every fall box where you did not get to choose and one is a serum so there's usually some like um, skincare products in here and this is by Way of Will which is a great brand that does appear in other subscription boxes this is the brightening face serum it says for a healthy and dewy glow fights free radicals and hydrate skin made with vitamins A and C and it has a 3750 value so not 38 not 37 3750 so let's just open this up. They usually have very like simple, clean packaging. I do like this nice orange box. And then here it is, you guys, very simple, clean packaging, nice little amber dropper bottle. And it is a brightening serum, which is great. And it doesn't even have like directions on here at all on the label. So I guess you just have to read up and know what you're using it for. But a little serum can't hurt. And that's kind of the uh, effort level that I can manage in my daily skincare routine. So happy to have that. Um, let me just see if it smells at all, if it has a scent to it. So hmm, it kind of smells like it's got some like vitamin E in it to me. Like that's 
doesn't mean it does you guys know I'm terrible with fragrances but it does smell like it's got that in there to me because I used to use it. so it says marula black currant and carrot maybe it's the carrot that I'm smelling hmm it says particularly high in vitamins A and C it doesn't say anything about vitamin E maybe it's just vitamin smell so the directions are apply two to four drops of serum in the palms and rub them together once warmed pat serum directly on face for best results apply serum on clean face after applying way of will face toner while, when skin is still moist well i have other toners but um i do like to stay within product lines when possible who knows maybe i even have that in, in stock in one of my uh, other cause boxes all right you guys the last item that everybody received and i'm actually okay with this even though i have a lot of bamboo cutting boards this is the core bamboo bamboo serve set so this was worth $35. It says prep and serve using this set made from one of the most renewable resources in the world, bamboo. That is absolutely true. Bamboo grows like a weed. It grows very, very quickly. So I'm going to see if I can just pull this plastic off so that you guys can actually see it without a ton of glare. I startled myself and jumped there a little bit. So I have a ton of bamboo cutting boards, but I do not have like these serving utensils. So you could definitely make a kind of heftier charcuterie board with these. I'm trying to make sure they don't fall out. Obviously you guys, I will take some pictures for you over on Instagram. So make sure that you're following me over there as well. I'll leave the link to my account in the description box below, but it's just Maui underscore Noel. So this is really nice. Um, it feels a little bit rougher. I think after a little bit of washing, it'll probably be a little bit softer and definitely work, but I can always use another Another, like wooden spoon and then I think these tongs are kind of cute they seem like they'd actually work pretty well let me know what your favorite item was in this box I think that $35 is pretty reasonable for that little set uh, it's a kind of thinner cutting board so I don't think you'd actually want to use it as a cutting board it's it's more of a serving board than a cutting board I'm pretty excited I know that a lot of people were sort of felt like this season's box was a little lackluster and they haven't sold out on this box the way they have in past seasons but I actually really like the towels I love the lantern it's still my favorite uh, the serum is great I think that this gel will be great for sore muscles um, I thought I think that I'll use everything in this box which is definitely not something I can say about other subscription boxes all useful all lovely seems like good quality let me know what you guys thought in the comments below if you did appreciate this video I would appreciate a thumbs up and hopefully I see you all very very soon in my next unboxing